What in the greasy fried chicken has been going on in the housing market in Memphis, Tennessee? In this real estate video, I'll share with you what happened during the month of February in the housing market here in Memphis, Tennessee. I'm Deborah Taylor, a licensed Tennessee real estate agent serving the greater Memphis region. Provide hard data, statistics, and real estate related information so that you, the housing buyer or seller, can navigate the housing process with ease and confidence. So if you like content like this, be sure to like and subscribe and turn on your notifications so you know the next time I upload a video. So here are the numbers for February. As you can see here, the, there was a 14% increase in the total number of units sold in 2024. The median sales price increased 4% to 195,000 dollars as opposed to last year in February 2023 when the median sales price was 188,000. By county, in Shelby County, the median sales price was 180,500. The total number of units sold was 1,003. This was an increase of 14% with a median sales price of 3.1%. In Fayette County, there was 11.9 or approximately a 12% increase in the number of units sold. In February 2023, there were only 42 units, where in February 2024, there was 47 units. The median sales price for Fayette County was 332000 this was a decrease from the year before where it was $332,900,000. Not much of a difference in price. In Tipton County, there was a 13% increase in the total number of units sold. The median sales price for a home in Tipton County was $300,000 as opposed to February 2023 when you could have gotten that house for 20 percent less at 250 thousand dollars so while this is a brief overview what do these numbers mean for you well first of all if you want to move to shelby county there still are some affordable homes however if you want to move to fayette county you're going to need to pay $152,000 more. Or if you want to move to Tipton County, you're going to have to pay $120,000 more. There's not a lot of homes in Fayette County or Tipton County. So if you're looking for some prime real estate out there, you may have to look a little bit harder than you would if you come on over to Shelby County. So that's it for the month of February. Until next time, bye y'all.